Hi there, I'm Tech and this is my channel Bootlosophy. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Parkhurst Brands Allen Boot in Dark Roast Dublin. <laughs> So this morning, this box from UPS arrived. Total impulse buy from Parkhurst. Um, I can't remember why I got onto the seconds page. I think someone in the group suggested that something might be on. Didn't think I'd want this, but then I saw it. The Allen and Dark Rose Dublin with a 602 last, uh, factory second. Parker's factory seconds are usually uh, not defects, but the returns or they might have been used for uh, modeling shots. Thank you for your appreciated continued support. Best, Andrew. Um, and as usual, they come in their boot bag. Oh, and that's a beautiful leather. I have a lot of brown boots. And for some reason, I gravitate towards them rather than black um, for whatever reason. And to be honest, on a reasonably brief glance, I can't really see any significant defects. It's Dublin leather, so um, you're going to see a lot of grain and, and, and uh, uh, rolls and creases anyway and yes I think there is a bit of a too much crease here but you know what as soon as I wear them on and break them in they're going to look like that anyway I think um, there are no significant defects where I'd say gosh that's a brand new boot it shouldn't look like that these sorts of defects I can live with because I think I'm going to wear them in there are no tears in the leather um, just a closer look at the vamp. Yeah, look, there's a little bit of creasing there, but that's where my toes will crease. Um, the shaft looks pretty good. Day-night sole. Well, I'm really pleased with this impulse buy. Saved, I think, nearly $100. Um, nothing wrong with that, really. They come with the round cotton laces. And I'm looking forward to trying them on. So here are my Allens in Dark Rose Dublin uh, on foot. They're very comfortable out of the box. The uh, leather insoles and midsoles, I think, take care of that. The leather is actually um, a lot firmer than uh, my other Parkhurst boots being the Spruce Kudu, the Natural CXL, and uh, the Raised Reverse Mohawk. Those are very supple leathers. This is um, a veg tan leather from Horwin, the Dublin, which I understand veg tanning does make quite a tough leather. Not uncomfortable. 602 last grips my heel and the side of my foot, but gives me plenty of room in the toe. Uh, next to my boots that I was wearing before these were delivered, the Thomas George collection from Australia. Yep, I think these will wear in quite nicely. There you go, I hope you enjoyed that. And if you did, please click on the like button below because that's going to help the algorithm get this out to many more people uh, who might like to watch it. And if you liked it, I'd ask you to subscribe to this channel as well because what I do is, once I've worn it for a few months, I'm going to do a longer term review of this boot so you can see whether it's something that you'd like. So click on the subscribe button and I'll see you soon.